Ball is out. Ball was out. Freddie Clark in midfield, and now Thewellen again straightens. Varney over the top to young Josh Hathaway. Puts the boot to the ball, and can he ground it? Magic from Hathaway and Gloucester score first in this West Country derby. Randall now goes blind, McGinty, options closed down there, Gabriel Ogre, Luatua, offload into Genge. Open play. Ball kept alive again. His feet taking the tackle, number seven. McGinty to Janssen and Rensburg slips the tackle, it's a two-on-one down the blind side. Captain Harding answers back immediately for the Bears. Wonderful score from the Bears, McGinty. Jansen van Rensburg so powerful, and picks the right option. Now it's McGinty, long ball to Malins, but it's Carreras who grabs it. And this time it's the Gloucester boys that are going the length of the field. Listen to the King's home roar. Santi Carreras plucks a five-point present out of the sky and under the sticks, and it's Gloucester that go back in front. McGinty tries the long ball, he's tried it a couple of times today, and Carreras reads it perfectly. They're all off sideline. Mercer, Carreras, Harris with numbers wide. Llewellyn, back to Harris, long ball. It's Adam McBurney. It's a try on his first start at King's Home, and look at what it means to him. He's barely been in the door a couple of weeks, and he is absolutely loving it. Gloucester scintillating at the moment. Sinclair. Randall now is space. Gabriel Ogre breaks through the middle, he's on his own, the Ogre, wonderful step! And Gabriel Ogre answers back away. for the Bears. Five tries in 25 first half minutes, and it's a King's Home Classic. Oh, it's an interception from Freddie Clark, has he got the legs? He's got Josh Hathaway outside him, he's got to find the young man! Oh, Freddie Clark! Let go of the ball, play on! All he needed to do was put the ball in the hands of the young flyer and Gloucester were certain for their bonus point. No. It fits Harding! Through the middle! Harding to Ibitoye! Can he find Magnus Bradbury in the corner? Bradbury! Oh, and the Bears go the length again. It should have been five points down one end for Gloucester. And I'm Bristol really make them pay. Over his own Bradbury now. Another strong game, Magnus Bradbury. McGinty to Dunn and Williams. Genge inside ball to Heward. Lovely soft hands. Noah Heward kicks through, and Randall and Heward are in pursuit. Noah Heward! Oh! Just spills the ball with the try line begging. Harry start using. The ball's with Randall and Ogre. Not bound again. Penalty advantage. Finding problems for Gloucester. Oh, lovely at the back to Gabriel Ibatoye. Oh! Play can on, he ground on. it? So nothing there coming back. That could have been the try of the season. Wonderful the play from again, McGinty. Oh, wonderful You're offload. Not fully bound. Twice. Now Wango trying to go through the middle. The Bears now two or three metres away. Can they breach this red wall? Magnus Bradbury! And they've done it, finally! Bristol have a reward for all the territory and all the possession. And this one's significant. A bonus point try with a conversion to put them into the lead. And makes no mistake. No! 
feet. Time is good. McGinty floats it to Janssen and Rensburg. And the South African is free. Bernard Janssen and Rensburg to surely yeah, take yeah, the yeah. game beyond Gloucester. Janssen and Rensburg, so powerful in every collision. And Bristol surely leaving Kings home with an incredibly valuable five points. Full time in a brilliant West Country derby. Gloucester 24, Bristol Bears 33.